biggest chirper on the field, probably Dale Stay. Um, I'm sure many of you have seen this vein sticking out of his neck. He's got quite a, I mean he's a hell of a nice guy off the field, but once he gets, on that fuse, that fuse flips, um, you'll see a little vein popping out of his neck here or even here in his, in his head and you know there's trouble coming. Again, it's a tough one. I think it's probably going to go to Dalstein or Vernon Philander. Um, as I'm sure you've seen, Vernon has got this new one where he just stands and you know, admires what he's just achieved. <laughs> so, yeah, it's a tough one. I mean, again, once uh, Dalstein celebrates, again, there's a few veins popping out. So, quite a quite a comical character. For any of the teams, unfortunately. Um, Quentin de Kock. Uh, again, the youngster in the team, we've all been there, we've all had our, our dark days and he's still in that phase of his, of his darkness. <laughs> so the naughtiest in the team is Quentin de Kock. <laughs> Unfortunately, again, he's the youngster in the team, so he's got all the negative comments, I guess, uh, in and around these sort of things. Um, look, he's a hell of a nice guy and you know, he'll, he'll give his best for you each and every day. But he's got a few things to learn still. This is, I'm gonna get JP back for this. He just embarrassed me like that. Cool guys, that's a bit of insight into the Proteus life outside of cricket. Um, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and remember, Proteus Fire.